Hey there, Keith Delmar here, and this is the Keith Delmar Morning Mindset. And today I'm here to give you some tips about how to attract things to you, how to attract what you want into your life. And now I've used a lot of these tips and tricks uh, myself throughout the years, and I just wanted to share some examples of how they've affected me. Um, I'll start with an example uh, that takes me way back, about 20 years of rocking back and forth on a boat in the summery seas of South Florida. And I was living on this boat and I said, you know what, all I, I want to live on land now and all I need is a little box to live in. A little box, very affordable, small box, would be perfect. And I really focused on just getting this small box. And sure enough, I ended up with a very small box, a very affordable place to live. Now, fast forward six years, I learned my lesson of living in a small box for six years. And I thought to myself, hey, I really focused on this place when I, and I was amazed when I got my small box because it was exactly what I thought it would be, okay? But six years later, I thought, no, I'm gonna do this a little differently. And I had a plan. Uh, this time, I asked big. I said, okay, I'm going to go with a big house, several rooms, tile floors in the kitchen, uh, central air conditioning, a pond, uh, fenced in yard, I had a dog at the time, big back porch to grow sprouts and other food and things. I got everything, right to the T. And I could actually afford it. And so the focus was there. I really focused on what I wanted and it showed up. And here I am, again, I'm just talking about attracting places to live and things like that. Um, I'll have to give some other examples. But here I am in New Zealand, living 20 years later, and I had some requirements. I said, I want a stream. I want bush. I want it to be a little bit different. So we built a cabin. We got a house. We got a bush. We got a stream. And we're in the middle of town, which was like a bonus. I wanted to live in town, but I still wanted all of these things. And I'm like, how do I compromise? What's going to have to give? I got everything. But I was really clear on what I wanted. So that's my message to you today, is be really clear with what you want. And don't sacrifice. If it's only in your mind, there's nothing to lose. You can do it. If it's in your mind, go for it. Just have a field day, have fun up there and get what you want. Really think about it really clearly, exactly what would make you happy and what would bring happiness and joy into your life. Focus on that and allow it to come. And you'll find the little things that you need to do to make it happen. Maybe you need to work, you know, get that job. Maybe you need to move to a different part of the country. Maybe you need to surround yourself with different people. Maybe you need to take some time out for yourself to do some writing and journaling so you can find out even what you want. Because you might be just so many thoughts and things happening in your head that you can't even focus. That's understandable. That happens. And another reason I think this thinking works is that when we do all this thinking, it leads us to subconscious doing. It puts the things in our head that we want and our brain knows what we want and then our subconscious leads the way. So by knowing fully what we want, we'll attract the people that will help us get there. We'll attract the things that will help us get what, what we need and we will get there. You just need to put it in your brain, focus, plan, have a bit of fun. Get the colors going on in there. Enjoy, enjoy. And uh, I hope it helps you too. So thanks for watching and I'll see you again next week. Take care.